I pouring in my coffee? Is it sugar? Wrong. It's actually a sugar substitute. And I started using these substitutes because I worked out almost two years, almost every day. I could not lose weight. I was eating one meal a day and a cup of coffee every single day. And the scale was not moving at all. And yes, it was frustrating, but I found some sugar substitutes that I wanna share with you guys today. So you're probably wondering, why should I cut out sugar? I'm just fine, I'm at my healthy weight, I'm healthy, I don't need to cut out sugar. Well, let me just tell you otherwise. When you add some sugar to your diet and it's in almost all the food products out there, so you have to be very cautious of what you're putting in your body, these sugars are adding up to extra calories and they have no extra nutrition. They're considered empty calories that can lead to weight gain and other health problems. I gained 60 pounds when I got married and this sugar was hitting in my food and I had no idea how I was gaining all this weight. Too many calories, no matter where they're from, they're gonna just cause weight gain. And you just gotta be careful because many of us are eating sugar and consuming it in a high amount and we have no idea. Whenever you eat this high amount of sugar, your cholesterol levels are gonna go up, your triglycerides, it's gonna affect your heart health, it's gonna make you gain weight, and you're gonna end up getting diabetes, some heart disease, high blood pressure, liver disease, and some other serious illnesses. I was pre-diabetic and it was a scary everything so you're going to cut your risk of getting these diseases if you just cut out sugar think about it many of us are still drinking soda and a single 12 ounce can of soda 39 grams of sugar and that's like a day's recommended dose according to the food experts that's way too much sugar so when you look at the back of your food products you see they have about 50 names and some of them could be hard to keep up with you have corn syrup high fructose corn syrup raw sugar cane sugar evaporated cane juice dextrose algae brown rice syrup coconut palm sugar barley marsh syrup and so much more so my first sugar substitute and this is actually me and my husband's favorite we use this sugar substitute from walmart it is called great value that's the walmart brand granulated no calorie sweetener and it's about 19.4 ounces and you can see the price which is seven dollars and 14 cents don't get discouraged by the price because remember we're talking about our health here and you just use it like regular sugar so you can uh, see the recipes you can make banana bread you can make some sweet tea you can make some pies out of it cakes the list just goes on on and on and on and the main ingredient in this sugar which is so important that I want to point out is something called sucralose and that's just a different kind of sugar in our body but it's a healthy sugar and then you have maldextrin as well but as you look at the carbs you see it's less than one grams of carbs and this is awesome it tastes really good the next sugar that I have gotten with my husband is called RX sugar and this is my least favorite because it has a weird aftertaste and it's kind of pricier it's $8.99 and it's higher in carbs, but it's a plant-based sugar and it's saying it's safe for diabetic. Many of us do have diabetes or pre-diabetic like I was and you don't want to get diabetes because it's not fun taking insulin every day or sticking yourself with a needle or being on pills. So they said that you can use this in coffee, tea, protein shakes. Uh, 1.25 cups of RX sugar is equivalent to one cup of regular sugar. This sugar is made with allulose and it's like a low calorie natural sugar. And it's different from regular sugar, uh, how it affects our blood and it doesn't raise up our insulin levels. And it is also good on our teeth as well. No one wants to be going to the dentist all the time because you're eating all the sugar and you got bad cavities. So this is another plus why I like sugar substitutes. So monk fruit is one of my favorite sweeteners. And this right here by this Le Canto brand, it is awesome. Do not get discouraged by the price because again, you're investing in your heart and it's like three pounds worth. And you can keep this for a, a long time if you use it correctly. So you see, it's a white sugar substitute. It has zero calories. 
It has zero net carb. You can use this for bacon, the zero glycemic index. It will not cause you to gain weight. Monk fruit is like a natural type of sweetener. It has my favorite sweetener in it, erythritol. And you can buy this monk fruit sweetener in like different varieties and you can just buy straight up erythritol as well. Again, I'll put all the links in the description. My next favorite sugar substitute is by Whole Earth, and I'm hooked on this. I use it every single day. It's monk fruit and erythritol, which is a plant-based sugar, and it's equivalent to one cup of sugar without all the calories. So this means that if I cook with this, my breakfast items or my baked goods, I can have this without gaining weight. Zero net carbs, just minus the erythritol from the total carbs, the alcohol sugar. Don't let the price discourage you because you are on a journey to health and this is worth investing in yourself. I have invested hundreds of dollars into low carb options, sugar, baked goods as well because I want to be around for a long time and I want to take care of my body. So my absolute favorite to do a lot of cooking and baking, try Swerve. I love this pack because it's three together and this is worth the $20.99. You have the granular sugar replacement, you have the confectioner's replacement and the brown sugar replacement. You get about 12 ounces, three packs, and this will last you a while. Um, some stuff you just need brown sugar for. And instead of using the real brown sugar, why not use Swerve. It has zero net carbs. And I have made cakes using Swerve, brownies, pancakes, waffles. They are absolutely amazing. The flavor is there and I cannot tell the difference between stuff cooked with Swerve or stuff with regular sugar. So you can see that they all have zero net carbs. The main ingredients to erythritol. One cup of Swerve is equivalent to one cup of sugar, zero calories, non-glycemic, natural plant-based sugar. They're making maple bundt cakes, orange creamsicle cupcakes. Imagine if you would just eat this really with regular sugar, you're gonna gain a few pounds and you're gonna have to go in the gym, try to burn those excess calories off from just eating that. But when you eat sweets with Swerve, you don't have to worry about spending an hour in the gym trying to burn those extra calories off because you ate smarter. So in this season, just eat smarter not harder and if you enjoyed this video if you would like more content like this give me a like subscribe and I'll see you on the next video finders